I'm subscribed to official IKO and Ramen. I'd like to point out her points and flaws in my point of view. Losing someone you love, her best friend, will make a big impact on your mental health. Because when you go to the six second mark, it goes, now IKO, make a proper apology. Video stating every single mistake that you made. So yesterday I mentioned about Little King Ryan being terminated. If you don't know who Little King Ryan is, basically Little King Ryan is the combo Canadian. Now all of a sudden it's like turned into the Pepe meme now. But that channel is now terminated. And I also mentioned about Ramen and also IKO because the drama is so intense right now between the copying, between the faking depression, between harassment, saying all these bad words, and also this fake apology. And there's so many people that comment down below my latest video so I figured to make another video to explain the situation. This should be the last video about this topic unless IKO responds to my video or even a Ramen responds to my video. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else unless something else happens that's like major that I shouldn't mention. But before we continue with this video, if you're new around here, subscribe, hit that notification bell. This way you can receive my videos once uploaded. So notification squad day is going towards Simp King, Cringe King, Althea, I don't know how to say your other names, but that's definitely good that we do have a new winner. Also, not pets, Android gameplays. So if you don't know, if you're the very first three people who comment down below, you get that instant shout out in my upcoming video. So if I was you, I'll hit that notification bell. Get that easy shout out on my channel. So this video might get a little juicy. I'm gonna try to stay neutral, just like the last video, even though it's kind of hard not to stay neutral, but I'm gonna stay neutral in this video as well. So let's first start off with the IKO because she's the one that's getting targeted right now because she got caught copying about five or six videos. It was literally obvious, but she did upload a couple videos. One of them says, please stop the drama. I know I did wrong. Please forgive. That video is kind of good. But you're not really explaining what's going on because there's so many things, so many accusations going against you, all these negative stuff you have to address. You can't just say stop the drama because if you say please stop the drama, you know what's going to happen? There's going to be more drama and more videos about you. And it looks like there is because there's so many videos about you, including this one as well. So she did make this post about four days ago that has 737 likes and might have more when you actually see this video. So she says many people are commenting commenting that I'm a gold digger or doing YouTube for money, but I'm not a gold digger, but I admit I'm doing for money. What? That doesn't make any sense. Like, wh which is it? Here's why. I don't really want to tell you, but I need to tell you because people have negative image about me. So, my family is not good with money. Now you may think how I had a phone then. Well, it's not my phone. It's our phone. I am bad at explaining, but I was little. I always tried my best to help my family get money. My father's a computer operator, and he don't have work. That much, my father usually had two jobs, but he got stressed out, so he quit. I know you didn't understand that clearly, but please notice we're poor. I'm doing this for my family. I mean, it is definitely a nice thing that, sh that she's trying to make an attempt to get more money for if this is actually true. It doesn't explain the copying. It doesn't explain all these other accusations about you saying all these negative stuff, all this inappropriate stuff, and apparently there's an alt. And there's another video saying proof of official IKO is, is being blank and toxic. Please read description and share this. This person actually commented my videos saying to check out their video. Hey, uh, I am Aora. If I said your name right, which I probably said it wrong. Apparently this is IKO's ex-best friend. I'm the main part of this drama. If you look through my videos, you see a post a bunch of proof of her bullying me and being blank. So I'll leave this video down below. It shows a bunch of screenshots. Apparently IKO has an alt. It's really hard to confirm if someone has alt, but there's many different attempts that might be proof that she might have an alt. So I received so many comments about IKO and also Ramen. So one of them goes, I'm subscribed to officially IKO and Ramen. I like to point out her points and flaws in my point of view. Losing someone you love, her best friend, will make a big impact on your mental health. I have the right to say this because I lost two of my closest friends. I felt upset, alone, and kept blaming myself. That was my fault for not being a great friend. Although, even though that I lost two of my closest friends, I did not become depressed. 
I'm sure that Fisher Aikoyo was just really upset that she felt like she was depressed. She's probably sad, not depressed. Depressed is like for like a long term period. Sad is like over like a short term period. That was straight up disrespectful to the people who were actually suffering from depression. That could be possibly. About the copying incident happening from two gotcha tubers, I'm pretty sure that IKO was the one who was copying Ramen. IKO's video was either uploaded 4 to 7 hours after Ramen's video was posted. I have no proof that actually happening because on YouTube it just shows the actual date of the video, doesn't show the time, unless you have the notifications on from both YouTube channels. And about her lifestyle, I'm sure that Aikayo uses her fans for money. Based on her police video, which I showed in the beginning, she needs to watch time from her fans to help her family need. I will do the same thing, but I don't want to copy other gotch tubers and fake my depression for clout. Oof. I'm going to just do what I do and wait for it to get recommended if I'm lucky. In conclusion, Aikayo is on a bad, bad, good state. It's okay to help your family, but don't copy others and fake your depression. Like, geez, have some self-respect, man. Wow. So we receive another comment saying, The thing with official Aikayo is way worse than that, Brett. She made a video attacking a boy called Amari Angest. I don't know how to say your name. Her fans to arrest this person, which was sent by IP grabbers, blank insults, the boy is black, and even wish him to be blank and blank. All just because he exposed her for being a liar, blank, and copying ramen. Wow, like what is going on with this person? Like honestly, if this is all true, that just shouldn't be happening whatsoever. So Raman actually made this video today saying officially IKO make a proper apology video and stating every single thing I stated. Wow. Before I was about to make this video, I saw this. I was like, okay, let me just check Raman's channel real quick. And I was like, wow, this is exactly what I would say if, if I was in her position right now. Because when you go to the six second mark, it goes, now IKO make a proper apology video stating every single mistake that you made. This is definitely a learning experience for you. You look like you're a young person right now for copying ramen and copying other people. All these inappropriate names, all these slanderous names towards other people. It shouldn't be on the internet, especially because your channel is growing so much. I checked out the channel, you gained 13,000 subscribers this month. I mean, YouTube's like giving you a gift right now, and you're not using this gift properly. If you do have an alt and you're using this alt to criticize and also harass other people, you shouldn't be on YouTube whatsoever. You don't realize the gift that you have right now because YouTube is pushing your content so much because you're uploading these five to ten second videos and getting, you're getting like 10,000, 20,000, 30,000 views on these five second video clips, which that's like absolutely insane. You're not putting any effort by putting a two second clip on YouTube. You should be thankful that YouTube's actually promoting your videos instead of attacking people and try to copy other people. Honestly, from this video, in my perspective, you should be making a video that describes everything. Try to not include your family. Try not to include all these excuses. Just say the reasons why you copied this person. The reasons why all these inappropriate and also slanderous words are going out from you. You should cover every single point that's going against you right now and prove everyone wrong. Otherwise, you're going to keep getting hate. Even though hate is a powerful motivator, it does help your channel. You don't want to have hate all the time because people are not going to subscribe to you because they like you. They're going to subscribe to you because they hate you. And they're going to constantly dislike your videos. So I can constantly put negative stuff in your comment section and it's not gonna be a good thing have an actual proper apology that actually describes everything or Have your channel go down the drain. So that was like a little rant right there I think this should be the last video about the situation unless ramen or even IKO Addresses in the comment section or actually makes a proper apology about the actual situation itself So let's do something positive. Let's do this squirt shot day So the question was who was the gotch tuber? They got caught copying in the latest drama. So the winner is Gotcha Renegade. The answer is officially IKO. So if you don't know, if you're the very first person to answer the question right, you get that instant shout out in my upcoming video. So if I was you, I'll hit that link down below. Come join my Discord server. You have to be at least 13 years old. So if you find any more information about YouTube hackers, YouTube combots, or YouTube scams, let me know down in the comment section below. Give you credit about that. If you're new around here, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. This way you can receive my videos once uploaded. You can also follow me at twitter the brett burns and also instagram brett that burns and if you want to purchase a t-shirt that link will be down below as well i'll see you guys in the next one peace guys thank you bye yeah i 
You never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right Yeah, I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right Yeah, I can only say that it feels right Oh, 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 oh,